our presentation for TomTom. Tom. So I just want everyone to stop and imagine. When you look up Charlottesville, you get flooded with all of these images of hate in our city, and that's kind of what it's known for on a global level. But we thought with our idea, we could maybe change that. But rather, TomTom Tom does it again. Through an, insightful, through an insightful and innovative new speaker series, we can spark just this series of community and unity amongst Charlotte Villians, and also just have a bunch of different new innovations through Tom Talks. Yeah, so basically the idea that we came up with um, to benefit the community um, was what Piper briefly talked about, which was Tom Talks. This is a badly edited version of the TED Talks logo with Tom Talk superimposed upon it. Um, this idea came about when we were discussing where we at least think Tom Tom should be um, focusing on building their company in the future, and we think that orienting themselves towards a more community service um, directed future would both benefit them in terms of their mission statement and also benefit the greater Charleston community that is in fact the goal that they um, told us they were interested in. And so the way that they would do this would be to create small speaker series or forums that would follow themes which would also be reflected within the community. So for example, these could start small with something about some speaker talking about a way they could help um, feed the homeless or shelter the homeless, but then this could later quickly expand to um, partner, partnerships with the Haven, working with other places within the community to make this really a, whole, a holistic Charlottesville-driven event to help um, help people. So logistically, um, if Tom Tom would like to pursue this um, Tom Talk idea, um, you know, we probably start you know in conjunction with us and Tom Tom trying to determine the cost and value from doing Tom Talks. Monetary um, kind of uh, metrics and also and harder to measure metrics as in uh, you know gaining uh, people you know getting people to kind of know about TomTom Tom and uh, helping raise awareness about TomTom Tom throughout the year. Um, once you get that, once you get that out of the way, um, you, can start, you can start planning uh, the TomTom Tom series. Um, you know it's it's pretty it's pretty cool. You know it can be similar to TED Talks. You can seek speakers for the events and uh, get local partners, um, sponsors, and food vendors to help try to make this happen. Um, and also get a venue. I know the regular Tom Tom Festival and Summit takes place at the Paramount, so the Paramount might be a great place to host some of these Tom Talk events. And uh, you know, we can advertise the event. And if the event takes off like we're anticipating, we can uh, help grow um, and possibly make Tom Talks monthly or even seasonal. Looking in the future, Tom Talks could be a standalone event separate from the festival and summit. Uh, in the future, um, Tom Talks could uh, partner with the Virginia Film Festival and become a not just a nightly kind of event. It could be a several day or week long event where there's a film, um, show screenings of new movies. Um, we could partner with uh, UVA to possibly do Tom Talks on UVA, at UVA. Um, and um, So why Tom Talks? How we kind of came up with this idea is we wanted to approach it from not only reestablishing Tom Tom as a whole year nonprofit foundation, but also just trying to better the community as a whole because that kind of seemed their mission when going through with creating Tom Tom. 